How to find a stolen iPhone. First of all, you're going to need the proper setup before your phone is lost. You're going to need operating system 5, that's iOS 5, in order for this to work. And iCloud needs to be activated, so you can go in your settings, find iCloud, click on that and make sure that the Find My iPhone button is selected to on, or this won't work. If you lose your iPhone, your first option is to go to iCloud.com. Sign in using your Apple ID and password. Once you're in, click on Find My iPhone, and hopefully a map will pop up with your iPhone on it. If it's nearby, you can click on Info and have it play a sound or send a message. If it's far away, you can remote lock it, remote wipe it, and if it hasn't been found yet, you can set up so that you get an email notification once it's found. Your second option is to use another iOS device. Search for the app Find My iPhone, install it, log in using your Apple ID and password, and once again you'll have the same options you did on the website. But hopefully your phone will pop up on a map. As my wife's did here, you can see I zoomed in and it appears her phone is in the center of this trailer. The last step is field recovery. In this case, I drove for an hour and found the trailer where my wife's iPhone was located. Now you might want to use the services of the police, but in this case, I decided that uh, I was safe enough to go it alone. Hola, hello. Uh, you, uh, I, I think my wife's phone is here. I politely but firmly explained that I knew my wife's iPhone was in their house, that I'd used an internet service to locate it, and that they could choose to either give it to me now or deal with the police later. My wife had left the iPhone in a movie theater the night before and somehow they got their hands on it. Simple as that. Problem solved, and I return home a hero. Thanks, Apple.